Добрый вечер. I'm glad to meet you here in this room tonight with our next round of screening of Ukraine-related films. And this time it will be a moving historical story about a Muslim girl who saved dozens of Jewish children. I'm very glad to introduce a few people who are here with us tonight. First of all, it's the director of the film, Akhtem Seytablayev. Who is a Crimean Tatar himself, and who is shooting the best films in Ukraine at the moment. We are very honored to have you here. He is here with his producer, Ivan Tedura, who did a great job on promoting the films. And this event wouldn't happen without the Molodist Kyiv International Film Festival, represented by Viktor Klon tonight. While we are waiting for the sponsors of this room, our MPs for Thornhill, Mr. Peter Kent, and the MP for Edmonton Griesbeck, Mr. Kerry Diot, they are, they are still voting at their company. I would like to invite Victor to have a few words explaining why we are here tonight and what you should expect. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you for coming here today. I just wanted to say that Baldi's Film Festival, together with the, uh, the Ministry of Informational Policy of Ukraine, are uh, organizing these events. We have a few, a little film turn in Canada, which starts to tonight in Ottawa. Tomorrow we continue with uh, Montreal, and then we end in, in the Toronto. So. Yeah, thank you for being here. I would also like to extend our gratitude to the ambassador of Ukraine to Canada, Mr. Andriy Shevchenko. And I would like now to forward my word to the director, uh, Artem Tsitablayev. Uh, It's a big pleasure to see a dear guests tonight uh, in this room. And it's very exciting to present our film here. Moreover, it's a very uh, important day tonight. Remember day. Uh, Remembrance day. And uh, it has uh, lots of symbolism for me personally. Uh, because right now Ukraine and part of Ukraine and Crimea are going through very tragic times. И власне народов, які мешкають в Канаді, не треба розповідати, що таке власна гідність. People in Canada should not be told what the dignity is. And what does it mean to fight for their personal human dignity and fight for their right to live? Because that's exactly what is happening in Ukraine right now. We're fighting for our right for life, for a peace, and for a peaceful sky above our heads. But our film tonight is not about the war. Although the war is present there too. Our film is more about the fact that the most tragic times it is about um, how important is 
to preserve humanity in ourselves in the most difficult times. І не важливо до якого етносу ти відносишся або до якої релігійної конфесії до якої церкви ти ходиш. And it is not important, it is not that important to what ethnicity you belong or what is your religion. Тому що якщо ти живеш в Всевишньому своїй душі, because if you have God in your soul, то молитва сказана будь-якою мовою задля порятунку дітей then the prayer said in any language to rescue the children will be definitely heard by God and will work. We dedicated our film to Crimea, although it was shot in Georgia. І в цьому теж є великий символізм, тому що в Криму ми знімати цей фільм не могли, але й знайшли частину своєї батьківщини в Грузії. And it is also a big symbolism for us, because we couldn't shoot this film in Crimea, but we found the same place in Georgia. І певний символізм, він драматичний, але й символізм, в якому є дуже багато людської гідності, Полягає в тому, що мій земляк Олег Сенцов. And a big symbolism, which is about human dignity, is about Олег Сенцов, my colleague. My colleague. Колег і вам сказано теж як земляк. Fellow man, countryman. My countryman, my countryman Олег Сенцов from Crimea. Над п'єси, яку я зараз працюю, щоб створити про неї фільм. I'm working right now on his dramatic piece to create a movie. Ми доволі багато з ним зараз спілкуємось через листування. We are in close contact with him by correspondence. І він знає, що зараз ми перебуваємо тут у Канаді. And he knows that we're in Canada right now. І передає вам всім вітання. And he passes big greets to you. Thank you. Я прийшов, якщо буде ваша ласка, запрошую вас підняти ці поруч з вами. In my turn, I'm inviting you to raise this... І давайте таким чином підтримуємо людину. And this is to show our support to him who is right now in prison, far, sorry, far away from his mother. Thank you, thank all of you, and let God bless you. Thank you, thank all of you, and let God bless Canada and save Canada. And thank you, thank all of you. Thank you very much, Ahtem. It's a very important moment and it's very important to see connections between today and the past. Um, I would like to say that uh, Ahtem's film was the first one that we screened being uh, still as the group of activists here in Ottawa supporting democratic changes in Ukraine. And it was on the day of remembrance of deportation of Crimean Tatar people. It was Hai Tarmat, shot also by uh, Akhtem. Uh, it was back in 2015. And since then, uh, we uh, started the uh, activist group as a film festival to shoot, to screen, and to promote Ukraine-related films and documentaries of various films supporting arts, supporting the information cause, but everything started from his film. So it's a very important person, not only for the cinematography, but also for the Ukrainian. This here is not just Ukrainian, is not just Ukraine related, but that the films that we are screening are about the cause that are important for other communities as well. Thank you very much to His Excellency Selçuk Unal, the Ambassador of the Republic of Turkey, who is here with us today. And uh, I'm also grateful for the representative 
of the um, Embassy of Republic of Moldova to Canada, representing Her Excellency <laughs> And also the representative of Cameron High Commission, His Excellency Anua Gewi Solomon Azohmdi. There are other communities present here. Um, I'm very flattered for your interest. Uh, thank you very much for that. While we are, are we still waiting? We are still waiting for uh, for our sponsors. It's very important to see them tonight, but I hope they will join us after the film. The film is uh, 86 minutes long, but I hope you will enjoy it that much that you will not even notice the length of it. After the film, we will have the Q&A session with the director and uh, we will also be able to take uh, any food and any beverages. Uh, by the way, help yourself. Don't be shy. Help yourself. I know that this is the end of the working day and people must be very hungry. So we will continue our program after the screening. Thank you very much.